you started off the session after the worst popular vote percentage in history. There was a messy start. You had to readjust to a new leadership. How are you going to learn from this as a party? Uh, it's a learning process uh, every day for everyone. Uh, but at the end of the day, I think that uh, we have accomplished a pretty good job defending everyone's interests. And uh, you know, we know that we have an important task ahead of us and uh, we're very, very confident uh, that we will be up to the challenge. And again, our task, our responsibility is to be relevant for and to fight for every, each and every Quebecer's interests that goes with, for instance, voting against Bill 96 uh, to defend each and every one rights. And uh, we, the Liberals, we are committed to, and dedicated to that, and we will not be doing like Quebec Solidaire, saying something but voting the contrary uh, the next day. So uh, we have to to continue in that. Uh, but and again, uh, there is always room for improvement. We are very very uh, aware of that. Our biggest challenge is to make sure that the government will do better. The government will recognize that we, the Liberals, have not all the solution, but very tangible solutions to be able to wake up that government. This is our task. This is our responsibility. So I will not uh, answer your question based on how people are perceiving us. We are working for the population. So our biggest challenge is to make that government understanding that it's not doing the job. And uh, in the meantime, Quebecers are suffering from that uh, light-headed government. How much of an impact do you think the Liberal Party had this session? We saw uh, during the last session that this, we saw and we put under the light this government's failures. And once I said that again, these are all the day-to-day -day challenges that Quebecers have to face, not getting access to the basic services. So I think that we need to continue our work uh, putting lights on what's going wrong and also to suggest. And as uh, the uh, leader mentioned, Monset Deragi, there are certain solutions that the government accepted. For instance, uh, the bill deposed by uh, our colleague Marois Risky uh, on the obsolescence. Uh, it's fine. Uh, Simon Jolin Barrette decided to depose his own bill. He just changed probably basically the cover page. But it, it, and it, we, we don't care about the copyrights. We'll be working in, uh, with, uh, within the uh, Alcovich's interest. So proposing such things, again, Don uh, Dorgan, this is another very tangible. There's a lot of other solutions that we put forward, and that's the positive impact that we can have. But again, denouncing this bad government, this is our job, and I think that the population to realize that and to add pressure to the, gov to the government, on the government to do better, that's the impact, that's our role, our responsibility.